Good morning, y'all. It's Friday, February 28th. Just leaving the uh, Blood Mountain cabins. It's almost 8 o'clock. We're heading up here to the Mountain Crossing store. I need some hand lotion. My hands are really dry and cracked. Um, Mike, the guy I was hiking with, we're going to do a shakedown of his pack. Um, yeah, so three days supply of food. Pack is full again. Not heavy. Feels good. Good night's sleep last night. If you have the opportunity to stay at Blood Mountain Cabins, I highly recommend it. 70 bucks for a cabin, um, 70 couple bucks for tax. And, uh, you know, so it was 36 bucks a person. So, piece of cake. Good stuff. I gotta find the trail back up to the road. Um, so, yeah, I highly recommend it. Sunny right now. Home for light snow later today. We'll see how it goes. So, getting ready to cross this little icy footwalk bridge. And I will get back to y'all shortly. Hey y'all, just starting up out of mountain crossings at Neil Gap. Decent little climb, feel stronger every day. That is Blood Mountain. That's the beast we came over yesterday. I'm glad that one's behind me. Um, if you're out there thinking about through hiking, don't wait till you're in your 50s to do it. Uh, I'm old. If you're young and able and you want to do it, start planning now and get out there and do it. It's a great experience. I'm having the, just the time of my life. Um, it's cold, but it's dry today, so um, it's a lot of fun. So life passes by quick. Get out there and have some fun. All right, let me get off here. We're going uphill again. We just had lunch dinner at the Gap, and uh, had our first trail magic. Roy stopped in and had a bag of oranges and bananas. That was the best banana I ever had, holy cow. That was good. What a great guy to do something like that on a, a day like this. You can see it's snowing again. It's like a blizzard out here at times. Um, but anyway, we just came out of that parking lot. I think this is Hog Pen Mountain. Holy cow, it's a 500 foot climb at least out of that gap. So, and it's straight up. It's short, but oh my golly, it's rough. We're still going up. So, about four miles to camp, heading toward low gaps, the goal. It'll be an 11 mile day. Feel good. Just need a minute to recover every now and then and keep stepping. So, a little bit easier every day so I'm uh, blessed with good health and the ability to do it just gotta make sure I keep my mind right poor guy back there at the gap he's like that's it I'm tapping out I'm done so it's that easy no thanks a couple more days I'll be in hot wassy might zero there. Hang on a second. There's some rocks. Here, let me give you a view. Stand by while I turn the camera around. There's your view. It's a freaking blizzard down there. <laughs> you can 
I can see down through the trees there at the bottom and it's just blowing snow, but it's awesome. So here's the trail, here's where we're going. All right. Hey y'all, going uphill again, but it's awesome. Hey, so I don't know what it's doing back home, but this snow is just amazing. These trees are beautiful. It must be kind of a wet snow, um, cause it's just stuck to everything, but it's pretty. So it's cold, it's snowy, what a beautiful day. It's awesome hard I'm not gonna get you, don't get me wrong it's hard but it's worth it all right let me get off here all right well I got a second trail looks pretty good here for a little bit um, this segment reminds me of the old Saturday Night Live skit, Deep Thoughts with Jack Handy. <laughs> These aren't so deep, but anyway, um, you know, there's kind of a, a peace that's come over me out here. Leading up to this trip, I was a nervous wreck, man. My gut was upset. I, I'd wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning. What have I forgot? What do I need? What haven't I planned for? Can I do it? Will I make it off the approach trail? I mean, just every thought that could go through your mind goes through your mind. And now, I'm out here stepping it out, heading toward an 11 mile day. I feel great. Um, the climbs are hard, I'm not gonna lie to you. But they're hard for everybody. Except these 20 year old kids that are out here. They're tearing it up, but God bless them for doing it when they're young. Um, but it's a good day. It's cold, it's snowy, big deal. Ain't nothing but a thing. But I just got this, you know, peace of mind that I can do this so far. Um, nothing hurts. Uh, things feel good. I mean, I'm tired at night, don't get me wrong. I sleep good, but, ooh, mud, sorry. Um, but it's going well and I'm enjoying it. I'm almost to the halfway point of getting out of Georgia. Uh, when I get to camp tonight, I'll be more than halfway out of Georgia. So that's a little mental milestone there. Um, so that's awesome. Um, looking forward to probably getting into Hiawassee in a couple days. Still debating on taking a zero there, I don't know. Uh, body probably needs a little bit of a rest and recovery. That Nero yesterday was awesome. You know, got in, got showered, got laundry done. Was able to just kind of lay on the bed, put my feet up against the wall. And uh, it was good. It was good. Good time. Go through my stuff, hang everything out, let it reel off, let it dry. It was good. So, anyway, I've started to ramble. Or, uh, let's see, monologue, I guess. So, all right, let me get off here. We're heading downhill. And uh, I'm probably about two and a half miles from camp at this point. Um, made good time today. Hard climbs, up and over. Keep getting it. Little sections of the trail like this, you can really step it out. So it's quite nice. All right. Get back to you all in a little bit. Hey y'all, it's uh, about 6.20, Friday evening, um, already had dinner, got into camp soaking wet, um, got into some dry clothes, 
I'm hunkered down in my hammock now trying to warm up. It's terrible. You can see my breath. Phew. Freezing. Looks like the skies are clearing though, so that's a good thing. Um, 11.3 miles today. Good day. Felt good. Um, just everything soaking wet again, deck on it. Um, but anyway, it is what it is. It snows more in North Georgia than it does in Virginia. Holy cow. Um, anyway, I'm going to end it here tonight so I can go ahead and edit this video and get it out. And I um, uh, appreciate everybody watching. Um, good night, and I'll see you in the morning.